All right, I'm going to give, give you a quick tutorial on how to create a survey using Google. So one of the first things that you're going to have to do is you're going to have to create a Google account if you don't have one. Once you do that, I'm already logged in, um, but anyways, it gives you menus up here at the very top. And we want to choose the Google Apps right here. This is where you'll find the Google uh, survey area. So you're going to click on that. And I'd go down to More and then choose Even More. Once this comes up, we're going to scroll down until we get to the Home and Office area, and there you'll find Google Forms, and it's, it allows you to build a free survey. So I'll show you a couple real quick things. Um, so first thing you want to do is you want to title your form. Uh, maybe you call it Demographics. And you could add a description if you want. You type that in, and then you could type a question. So I'm just going to type a real simple question. I'm going to just say it's a gender question. And then under the options, you just click over the option one, we can call this male. And then option two, we can call that female. And once you're done creating the questions, and these are um, kind of radio button questions, you can choose all kinds of different types of questions. Once you're ready to add a new question, you're simply gonna go over here, and then you're gonna add a question. If you wanted to change the response type, you simply go to the pull down arrow and it gives you a variety of different responses from short answer to drop downs to check boxes. So you can choose what type of um, response you want depending on the type of question. In addition to that, once you're all done with your, your survey, I'll show you um, uh, briefly how to send it out real quick. If you want to send it out via email, you just click on the send button up here. And you can enter email addresses and then just send an email out to individuals and ask them to take it. You can also choose to uh, send out a link. You can copy this link and they have access to the survey and then they can complete the survey. Or if you're using something like Blackboard or some other learning management system, you can embed the link right into Blackboard and then the people can complete the assignment uh, via Blackboard. So I'm going to close this just a second. Um, some other things too, just to point out, over here besides the question, you can change the uh, title and the description, you can add images, you can add video, um, you can add sections to it. There's a variety of different things you can do. If you make a mistake on a question, you want to get rid of it, you can simply hit the delete button and delete the question. So I think if you get in and you play around with it, you'll start to understand how to use it. The other thing is when you're ready to view responses, what you'll do is just simply click on the responses. You can see that there's zero responses right now, but if you handed this out to your class, you could count how many of them actually took it. You could go over here to the create a spreadsheet and what this will do is it'll create a spreadsheet that allows you to download um, this in a uh, Google Sheets form and then you can export that as an Excel spreadsheet and bring it into SPSS or SAS or whatever it is that you're using. So I'm going to click cancel there and hopefully this gives you enough information to get started with uh, playing around with Google uh, surveys or Google Forms.